be strong. What's good, J2FL? Back again with another reaction video for you guys. I'm Jeremiah. I'm Johnny. So today we are checking out Taylor Swift, The Prophecy. But before it's a bit of a not part of Jay Tour family or it's your first time on our channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you check us out on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Patreon. Also, on our Patreon account, we have a react to a numerous amount of tours by Taylor Swift. So if you guys want to go check that out, definitely go check it out. Consider it definitely for sure. You know what I'm saying? But this is called The Prophecy. What do you think about it, John? Obviously, The Prophecy is something that is, you know, telling something that's going to happen in the future. Um, so I wonder if it's maybe. A uh, prophecy that she's saying, you know, that she wants to come true. Maybe she's talking about, you know, maybe getting married, maybe having kids, something like that. Maybe something in the future with her career, maybe something like that. Or maybe, maybe this is after she had met uh, Travis Kelsey, and maybe this is where she wants it to go. I don't know. That's my thought. I mean, that sounds pretty good. So I'm thinking like, uh, maybe, maybe uh, she fell in love with like the wrong person. She knew that she was like bad for, or knew that he was bad for her and everything, and. In a sense, like she could see like where it was going, but she still let it happen anyways. Possibility. Something like that. That's what I'm going with. Let's see what happens. Let's do it. Hand on the throttle, thought I caught lightning in a bottle. Got cursed like Eve got bitten. Oh, was it punishment? Pat around when I get home. I guess a lesser woman would have lost hope. A greater woman wouldn't beg. But I looked to the sky and said, Please, I've been on my knees. Change the prophecy. Don't want money, just someone who. My company, let it once be me. Who do I have to speak to about if they can redo the prophecy? Damn, that That's right deep, there, bro. Like that, those lyrics right there is like, like sad. Yeah, super, super sad. Like it's almost like you're begging for this one for your up. life to change. Yeah, for your life to be different. And that's crazy. And all she wants is just like yeah. someone's company. She just wants yeah. to. Yeah. Like, she wants to be someone's company. She wants somebody to want her to be around. Yeah. Man, that's sad, bro. Wants be me. Who do I have to speak to about if they can redo the prophecy? Cards on the table. Mind play out like fools in a fable. Oh. It was seen. Is the quicksand poison blood from the wound of the pricked hand? Oh, still I dream of him. Please, I've been on my knees. Change the prophecy. Don't want money, just someone who wants my company. Let it once be me. Who do I have to speak to about if they can? Prophecy, and I sound like an infant feeling like the very last drops of an ink pen. A greater woman stays cool, but I howl like a wolf at the moon. And I look unstable, gathered with a coven round a sorceress table. A greater woman has faith, but even statues crumble if they're made to wait. I'm so Just a paper weight in shades of gray. Spending my last coin so someone will tell me it'll be okay. Bro, this shit, this shit is sad, dog. I ain't gonna lie, man.
Seven on my knees Change the prophecy Don't want money Just someone who wants my company Let it once be me Who do I have to speak to About if they can redo The prophecy Hand on the throttle Thought I caught lightning in a bottle Oh, but it's gone again Pat around when I get home I guess I'll let the woman get a lost home Greater woman would say But I love to do the sky and Bro this shit was kind of heartbreaking. I ain't gonna lie. No, man. it definitely was. God damn. That was that was Dang. definitely heartbreaking. And, and like I said, that one set of lyrics there, that's like the saddest thing you could like almost ever read. Yeah. Yeah, she even like said like at one point, like a uh, greater woman pretty much wanted like be begging, but she's begging please. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's like she will do whatever, whatever uh she can to sit there and just change the future in a way. You know what I mean? It's just crazy. But, I mean, that was beautifully written. It really was. I mean, it was just super fucking sad. Like, super fucking sad. It's almost like she went through, like, so much already. Yeah. And she's just, like, begging for, like, a break. You know what I mean? Just change. Just, just what she, what can she do to, like, change? Who does she have to talk to? Or whatever the case might be. She just wants something to change. You know what I mean? She just wants uh, someone to want her company. Uh, and I feel like that's just tough, man. It, it really fucking is. I mean... That's just so fucking heartbreaking. Just like the, the that set of lyrics, like you said, it was heartbreaking as shit. Like, it really fucking was. I did not expect it to be like this. I know we barely fucking paused throughout the whole thing, but I'm like, man, this is depressing. Yeah. Like, it really fucking was. But amazing fucking song. Very well written and everything. It was just super fucking sad. But what you think, Johnny? I, I, I think, you know, with that song there, she, like, kind of could hit a bunch of people with that, too. And, like, you know, that could hit... You know a bunch of people really hard and they can understand you know in in that same situation because i think for a lot of people a lot of people just want to be wanted you know they don't want to have to you know do anything they just want who they are to be wanted by somebody yeah. else you know they don't want to have to put on a fake face they don't want to have to be different around that person they just want to be themselves and be wanted for who they are and i think a lot of people can relate with that this was a great song she beautifully written some of the saddest lyrics, like I said on that one spot there, some of the saddest lyrics I've ever read once you really think about it and you really look into it. But it such a beautiful song at the same time. She has that talent and that ability to do that is make something sad and beautiful at the same time. But it, it was it was fantastic. It really was. Yeah, but I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, make sure you hit the like button. If you're not part of J Tour Failure, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you check us out on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Patreon.